Well, hello. Come in and welcome to Playwrights Roundtable. My name is Gary Allen. Playwrights Roundtable is Central Florida's only year-round producer of original stage works. Writers are nurtured and critiqued in a free monthly workshop. Eventually, many of these scripts are developed into one-act shorts and showcased as a PRT production. And lucky for you, I have one of those shorts. Today's play is about a group of inept adventurers who must figure out their next battle plan in a world of magic and monsters. The play is called Battle Tactics and is written by Andy Hayes and directed by David Strauss. So pull up a chair, sit back, relax, and enjoy Battle Tactics. Wonderful job, Aldwin. You've safely led us through the dungeon to the Ogre King's lair. Well, such is the way of Aldwin. The cunning. Let us charge in, Sandane the Righteous. I wish to end this quickly. Hold your horses there, pal. I want a solid battle plan this time. No repeats of the succubus fiasco, Taylor the Pantsless. I wish to speak with someone about changing me name. Not the time. Uh, Aldwin. Speak your desires and Aldwin the cunning. Shall comply. I want you to sneak in under cover of shadow and take a position directly behind the Ogre King. Then, when we charge, you leap forth and sneak attack him. Aldrin approves of this plan. And I hope we can count on you not to flee as soon as you're seen. Well, <laughs> such is the way of Aldrin the Cunning. It better not be, not this time. I want you in there fighting with us toe to toe. Aldrin will see what she can do. Eh? <laughs> Great. Uh, Pragus the Illuminator. Illuminate! Oh, stop, stop. No illuminating. But what if it's dark in there? Don't worry about that. I want you in the back summoning magic missiles and whatever else it is that you do. Illuminate. Except illuminate. <gasps> Could it be that finally Aldwin will be able to sneak around in peace? At least with the light on, we were able to see you sneaking away once the battle began. Without the light, there'd be no need for Alvin to sneak away. Oh, how convenient! We either get to watch you running away with the light on or have to trust you're doing something in the dark. You want to see Alvin do something right now? Stop, 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 stop! stop. Right she started it! Well, I'm ending it. Everyone, please! If we could get back to the matter at end! Thank you! Perhaps something like Taylor the Terrifying will evoke the appropriate amount of fear in our enemies. Ooh, you really want to avoid alliteration in the title? It makes you sound like a stupid bard. Oh, Taylor <laughs> the Illuminator. I'm Again? adventuring with oh, don't children. Care for it. People, focus on me. Can we please? Just go in there and fight the Orc King. Or? Shh. Or whoever the heck it was we were sent here to kill and discuss this later. But I was going to pick that up. Do you have today. any friends? What if it's all right with me? Fine. Wait, wait, wait. Thank you. Aldwin, if you'll start us off, the rest of us on three. One, two, <laughs> three. Illuminate! Seriously? <laughs> I honestly don't know what to say. Does anybody have anything to say for themselves? At least Aldwin Z. Cunning was on Injet. Yes, Aldwin. We were so worried you might have sprained your ankle running away so fast. Aldwin did trip over some clothes or something as she fled. <clears throat> Tactically retreated? I wonder what those could have been. Well, I for one am not entirely certain where we went wrong. Really? Well, allow me to illuminate you. 
What's the one thing I asked you not to do? Illuminate. And what's the first thing you did? Illuminate. So where do you think we might have gone wrong? Taylor losing his pants? <gasps> Is that what Alvin trips on? We're not on Taylor, we're still on Pregas. I don't think it's fair that you ask Pregas, the oh. illuminator, not to illuminate. You would not ask Alduin, the cunning, not to be cunning, or Taylor, the pantsless, not to be pantsless. I asked both of them both of those things. Point withdrawn. If I may. Something to add, pantsless? Well, I don't think you're being very righteous right now, Sandane the Righteous. More like Sandane the Self-Righteous, eh? <laughs> <laughs> Oh, no. No, no. <laughs> Do not turn this back on me. I did everything right. It's you people who couldn't handle it. Look, guys, I'm sorry. I didn't mean it. No, you're right. <laughs> My life is a lie. <laughs> no, it's not. <laughs> Illuminating is, is very important. <laughs> See, without you, we might not have known if this was the right Ogre King that we were sent here to fight. And, Aldwin could have seriously injured herself tripping over Taylor's pants, but uh, you lit them up nicely. Come on, you just need to not surprise us with it, that's all. How about this time we start with you illuminating everything immediately. That way, everybody can see everything and nobody's surprised. And then we can move on to some of the other spells I'm sure you know. You just say the word and... And I'll be ready. Great. Ahem. Now that you've given Torchlight over there permission to lead us off, you left Alduin the Cunning very little to do in our future battles. Ah, not hardly. Alduin the Cunning, you are the greatest acrobat I have ever known and adventured with. Mm -hmm. Instead of going for the single sneak attack, why not bounce around and harry your opponent from all sides? That way, he'll see you but never touch you. The persistent harasser. Definitely weaving between blows, setting up openings, exploiting weaknesses. Yes, yes, I'm an approach of this ah! man. Ah! Oh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. It's so I, I got carried away. Hey. Come on. Fuck up. Just few some times and letting me barbarian ancestors down. Me great grandfather and I wouldn't have been caught dead going into battle. Fully clothed. Yes, but and this is just a suggestion. Maybe you could embody that barbarian spirit better by taking your shirt off. I meant instead of, but uh, okay, we'll think of a new name for you later. Uh, all right, all right, people, huddle up, huddle up. Aye. Ow. I realize we've suffered a few setbacks today, but I think we've made some major breakthroughs and we're going to come out of this a more cohesive unit. Now, the Ogre King, once he stopped laughing, was nice enough to let us come back out here and regroup. I say we go back in there and show them what we're made of. Who's with me? Alwyn the Cunning awaits your command. Gregus the Illuminator shall light the way. <laughs> I'll take that as a yes. Gregus, would you like to start us off? <laughs> Illuminate! Oh! Well, that's all the time we have for now. Thanks for watching Playwrights Roundtable. Are you a budding playwright? Many of our writers have gone on to present their works around the country. If you'd like to see what's happening at the PRT, check out their website for monthly meetings or join them on Facebook. Till next time, 
I'm Gary Allen for Playwrights Roundtable. <laughs>